Alright, a lot of people look at my anti-statism as being a blind faith or a simple hope. That's not the case. If it was a hope, that'd mean that I wouldn't know there's good stateless societies, or better yet, that they're good because they're stateless. And then, I know I don't know this, I don't know if this is sure. I know that I'm not sure, but I still desire it. And this is definitely not the case. And for something to be a faith, um, you mean that I'd think I know this, but I have no reason to back up my beliefs. And that's not true because I have reasons. I have empiricism. Not just rationalism, empiricism. I actually look at stateless societies that are good, and then I try to decipher if it's because they're stateless that they're good. So that's another thing that you could end up getting wrong. You could make a correlation causation fallacy. I could look at Freetown Christianity and say it's stateless and it's good, therefore it's stateless because it's it's good because it's stateless. What if it's the case that um, the re real reason it's good is probably because it's been having corporations or things of that nature? Well, I can find arguments. I can use rationalism to decipher that. And really, that's probably what sets me apart from that stereotype that I'm just some kid who doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about and he's just having blind faith or anti-statism or anarchism or libertarianism and that's probably not the case for one thing I try to make and find the possibilities for the state reasons why there's certain things that not just make the state extremely inconvenient but on the verge of collapse inevitably because they have certain planned chaoses because there's a calculation problem because there's something that they're not getting through with together and I've come up with two when I've wrote written in anti-statism circa 2011 and the other my up and coming anti-statism circa 2012 but there's also the arguments that a stateless society is just better because there's tremendous conveniences towards it whereas with a statist society there's a tremendous amount of inconveniences with minarchy those inconveniences sort of close up they become tighter but they still exist and I support both theories it's usually that you either think that states are extremely inconvenient or you're like me and you think they're extremely inconvenient and there's a like little calculation problems, little disorder that happens from a state. And that's what I try and come up with. Those are my little theories. And so it's a belief. It isn't faith. It isn't come up with reasons, I make those anti-statism circa 20 whatevers to basically prove to people that it's not just some faith, it's not like I'm a generic jobber anarcho-libertarian who says stuff like extortion is evil and then he gets his ass kicked by the simple phrase why simple little fragment why that's not me sure I get my ass handed to me a lot of the times but it's because I may say stuff that's incorrect I may make a little bit of factual errors that's usually what kills me it's a good thing because it means I perfect myself plus the only time people ever comment on my videos is because they're either people who don't know about the philosophy and 
think, wow, this guy's interesting. You're really bright. Or the people who notice a little mistake I might make, like that mispronunciation of Noam Chomsky, or the time I mentioned something about the don't tread on me flag, tread on me, which had a historical error, cultural error to it. Or am I what's commonly private, what's commonly communal video where I kind of left like shelter alone and then some guy had to fill in that stuff for me. So it's always when I'm wrong that people or incomplete about something that people come in and try to make reformities. And I appreciate that. I like when people make reformities to my arguments. I take whatever I find is agreeable because that's how my belief system works. Yes, a belief system, not a system based upon faith or hope, a belief. Alright, did I really need to take six minutes? Yes, it did.